We have to get you up there. I picked up an ascension cable. See anything I can latch onto? How's this? I thought you were off traveling the galaxy. What are you doing on Jeddah? Jeddah is part of the galaxy now. Good to know. I visit Seer from time to time. When I heard the Mantis was arriving, I offered to guide you. We must get to the other side. Yes, that could work. Good. We should hurry, Cal. A storm is coming. Sure. I don't like the sound of that. We need to take them down before more arrive. Just like that time on Narshada? Precisely. I'll follow your lead. That's a first. Speeder. Even if the storm subsided, Seer is too far to reach on foot. Nice. What are you thinking? Might be able to hitch a ride. All right. Follow me. You haven't learned to fly yet, have you? Afraid not. Then there. See it? I do. You haven't lost your edge. BD seems a step slow. <laughs> I'm going to take a joke, droid. <clears throat> Through here. <laughs> Not stuck, are you? <sighs> this spit. The way is blocked. Whoa, watch out! Are you trying to kill me? Sorry, I thought. It's all right, Cal. Stand by. I will fix this. What are you doing? Restoring the pattern you threw into chaos. Incredible. That looked exhausting. You need a break? The storm is coming. I will rest when we arrive at Seer's base. Where did you learn that? Tathamir. You went home? Yes. My sisters are gone. <laughs> Their wisdom remains. <laughs> ah, the spammels. They stopped at an oasis. Getting closer. <sighs> the creature is gone, but it will return. 
We should never have made this journey. May the Jedi protect us. Let's stop here. All set. No word yet. Keep trying to establish contact. When you're ready. I really liked that speeder. You got it? Of course. I'll meet you on the other side. What is it, buddy? of you. I know. They have taken to calling me the Desert Ghost. Desert Ghost, huh? Haunting Imperials has become a hobby of mine. It must have taken lifetimes to build this place. Now the people who built it are gone. I came across the remnants of many civilizations during my time. <laughs> Check out our kit.
who this was? I don't. But Seer might. BD, does he look like Cal? Comes in handy. If that was a joke, I hope you fall. Enemies up ahead. Getting closer. We will shelter in Seer's base. It is hidden from the Empire in the high desert. I hear you, BD. Let's see. Scryton lair. But where's the Scryton? Something's coming. We'll take him down together. Agreed. this. Help me out. Must I? Thanks. Seer would be disappointed if I left you to die in the desert. The Spammel. You really think you can tame one? Worth a shot. An oasis! We're saved! Now we have the strength to reach the crossing. May the Jedi watch over us. Good job. Is the base far? Not with our new friend. And now we have time to catch up. No kidding. It's been years. You must have seen the entire galaxy. Almost. How was it? Amazing. The sinking city of Karatao. The Prasaya Cliffs. This galaxy suffers. <laughs> Any run-ins with the Empire? Yes. These are dark times. I helped those I could. Just glad you're all right. You as well. Wherever I went, you were never far from my thoughts.
We've avoided Seer for years. Why visit her now? I need her help. We're looking for something connected to the Order. Interesting. Are you still upset with us for leaving? I didn't see it coming, Marin. All of us going our separate ways. I understand, Kel. But we had our reasons.
can't be. The Spamel must have found shelter. This way. Okay. The Spamel saved us. So we can forgive it for leaving us to die. Agreed. Okay. Should be set for the night. Sit. Tell me what adventures you and BD have had since we last saw each other. All right. Same as always. Fighting the Empire, helping out where we can. Not staying in one place too long. And, um... I think we might have found something special. A place where the Empire can't find us. But it would mean leaving the fight. And well, the fight is all I know. Cal. Look into the fire. It will warm you. Keep you company. On dark, lonesome nights, yes? But left unchecked, it will consume everything in its path. Until there is only ash. But on a cold night, like tonight, a warm fire is perfect. And the company is not so bad either. I missed you, Marin. And I, you. I had to leave, Cal. In order to see the galaxy on my own terms. What'd you find? Myself. Reflected in all the places and people I encountered. Dathomir will always be my home, but... It does not need to define me. I never understood why you left. But... Sitting here now... It's clear you made the right choice. You missed a spot. Morning. The weather has cleared. Let's go. Heads up, E.D. Well, we survived our first storm together. Yes, we did. I'm glad we got to see each other again. How long are you staying on Jedi? I don't know. But I am excited to see Grease. How is he these days? Not bad. He opened up a cantina. Hyloon Saloon. 
looks after his great grandmother. Nothing's more important to Grace than family. told me everything. You have demonstrated great bravery and wisdom in the face of overwhelming adversity. You chose well? Well, <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. <laughs> the Empire has claimed the ruins. We'll have to find another rendezvous point. Unfortunate. But at least the storm covered your tracks. Come. Come, let me escort you inside. Master Cordova, did you find the Zepho? Only faint traces of their passage heading deep into the unknown regions. Sorry to hear that. As it goes. Ultimately, that failure inspired me to seek out other Jedi survivors. That search led me back to my old apprentice. How have you been faring, Cal? That doesn't sound good. I've had a few scrapes, but I'm still breathing. And I'm glad for it. I heard some news about a Jedi terrorist on Coruscant not long ago. You were on Coruscant? Well, Romantis looks like it's seen better days. You should see the other guys. This base is well hidden. Yes. Well, the Empire's presence has grown these past years. They are much too strong to fight directly, but we do what we can. It is critical, of course, that our work remains secret. What work exactly? Better to ask Seer yourself. Meanwhile, Marin and I will greet our new arrivals. So, how is the desert? Cold, stormy, and too many Imperials. Mm, not my preferred weather forecast. But more common by the day. Where did you weather the storm? A cave past the old market. Our Spamel friend showed us the way. You have a habit for making new friends wherever you go. A survival instinct, perhaps. I intercepted some Imperial communications. Your reputation is growing. Was there fear in their voices? Quite a bit, yes. Good. How are you feeling? Better. That tea you brought me was wonderful. Reeves must be in the kitchen. We'll meet up with them later. No lift platform here.
Just keep trying. It's not like Brother Armai has to break contact. Cal Kestis. Welcome to Jeddah. I knew the storm wouldn't deter you. You're rebuilding the temple archives. And we're trying. As long as this knowledge remains, the legacy of the Jedi survives. It's incredible. Mm -hmm. But something tells me there's more to this than just hollow books. Yes. We're a part of a network known as the Hidden Path. We provide safe passage and new identities to those who have been persecuted by the Empire. Hunted by the Empire, like... Like Jedi survivors? Very few of us remain. But yes, and Force sensitives, and those who help them. Why didn't you tell me? <laughs> you never asked. Besides, I hear you've been busy making yourself the Empire's most wanted. I wanted to prove to the galaxy that the Empire isn't invulnerable. That you can resist. That you have to fight if things are gonna get better. And then they just listen to the propaganda and they pretend they're free anyways. Hmm. You chose a hard path. And it hasn't made a difference. Well, while the Empire's trained its eyes on you, we've been able to build the network. Find allies. And save lives. left now you just given up I was wrong Cal you were just a child when they sent you off to war you know there was a time when I remember that the Jedi were more than just weapons but we both have our roles to play in this struggle. Yeah, but that's why I'm here. Seer. Well, you get a load of this! Hey, Seer, you can't say it ain't short of personality, <laughs> but kind of creepy, though. <laughs> well, it's good to see you two, Grease. <laughs> <laughs> well, oh, hello, uh, BD. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> so, how was your time in the desert? The storm covered our tracks, but... The Empire destroyed one of your speeders. It's a small price to pay for everybody's safe arrival. And who's this? This is Bodokuna. He is a friend. It's so nice to finally meet you. Uh, it's hunk of trouble! <laughs> hey! We're all together! <laughs> yes. Now, what brings you all to Jeddah? We're searching for a lost planet. Tantalor, you ever heard of it? It's on the other side of a deadly nebula called the Kobo Abyss. Well, our archives are far from complete, but I'm sure Master Cordova is up to the task. With pleasure. The trouble is, we're not the only ones looking for this place. I knew this was sounding too easy. The guy's name is Dagon Gera. He was a Jedi. Now he leads a band of raiders on the Outer Rim. There's an old temple there. Dagon intends to reclaim it. A Jedi temple out of the reach of the Empire could mean that there's information there that we don't have in the Archive. I believe I have something. <laughs> oh, you're too kind, BD. <laughs> I'll start with the bad news. Well, boy, this guy knows his audience. <sighs> I found no information related to crossing the Kobo of this. However, I found two mentions of this Dagon Gera. He had a retreat on Kobo. And records show him frequently visiting a laboratory on its moon. Okay, we'll check him out. If you find anything, bring it to me. I am happy to assist further. Thank you. Both of you. You're welcome, Cal. I hope you find what you're searching for. May the Force be with you. And with you.
I will escort you back to the Mantis. So you're not joining us? I cannot. 